Hello everybody, my name is Hoppin L, and this is going to be a tutorial guide of the Void Bow. So you run down the stairs, over, near, above, double tap, shoot the little symbol I just shot, pick up the quest, and it'll say release me. And then what you want to do is probably grab a good knife, I grab the bowie knife, go in Void Room, um, you, that's what me and my friends call it, there'll be like a little purple square in the middle. Just gotta kill a zombie by knifing it on top of the square. And crouch, hold square, and your race will come up saying, Return that which is scattered. And what that means is you gotta grab six skulls around the map. So, one of them is down here next to Mule Kick, which I normally go down and take. Right here, hold square, pick it up. And then the next one will be over here by double tap. Hold on. Over here, pick up the skull, hold square. Now, I had a little mistake here. Um,. There's one in Samantha's room in the toy box, but I have a little error. Sorry, but um, that's how it goes. Just hold square on it. And you'll go up here next to the church. Hold square on it. Go down to teleporter on the right. There should be a sink. Hold square on it. My friend left without me. I'm sorry about the um, Samantha's room part, but the pink room on the left upstairs next to the first dragon everyone does. It'll be a toy box, and the skull will be right in there. If you just run around the room, you can find it. Down at Rocket Pad, there's one more over here next to the truck. Hold square, and you'll get the last one. Then you want to come back to your room, and it'll say, The broken skulls must be sacrificed in my honor. What that means is you gotta grab six crawlies and push it into the room, and then it'll, um, the skulls will eat it. Um, do not kill the zombies while the skulls eating it, because it'll break the game. But after that, um, you get three words. There's heart, crown, and horn. That's what I got. And when you hold square onto these knights, you'll get symbols. There's That was heart. That is griffin right there that you just saw. There's stag. Then over here is door. And then there's crown. And then right up here is horn. My guy in the game forgot his code. And if you forget it, just do a non-charge blast onto the base and you'll remember it. And then, bam. Hold square, you don't have to stand from it, I just do that so I can remember it. Go over here, hold square again, and you get um three codes. Um I just had a little um share factory error that happened sometimes. Um but after that you want to go around killing zombies around the map and try to get your three codes. This is what one of them looks like. And they disappear really fast, so try to hurry up and grab it. But um tape in the code that said so mine was crown, heart, and um Horn. So I tape it in that code, tape in the codes I saw, and I'll say that is the name. If you get it wrong, skulls will be going around the room killing you, so you want to book it out there if you got it wrong. But if you got it right, they will be going around the base. Um, then you don't need to run away like what I just, I just did that for some unknown reason. But then you want to go um, over and there will be this purple little void thing. Hold square on it. Your little arrows will go in there and you'll be Gucci. But soon your reforged arrow will pop out, pick it up, and I'll see you guys down at the Undercraft. There we are at the Undercraft. You place it down, get your max ammo. My friend here was filling up the wolf bow, but I started using it later on so I can get my void bow. So, I'll show you gameplay of the void bow. Pick it up, you do a full charge shot, you get three portals you can shoot down. Um, a non-charged shard just makes one little skull pop up, but look at that. Look how cool it is. Look at all the damage you're doing. It's pretty great. Now, I hope you guys really enjoy this video, and I got a little um, message in here. Um, if you guys seen any dank meme words, how, how many there are? Because